The Devil's Favorite Demon. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from parts unknown. Weighing in at 323 pounds. King! One of the most dominant destructive forces in the history of WWE. Multiple world and tag team championships and more destruction to come. And here he comes. And you can sense the anger emanating from the competitor tonight. Eyes like a blazing fire. This is a man you don't want to be in front of right now. He's a man possessed is what he is. Yeah, and Kane said his opponent has forgotten who WWE's true monster is. And he'll remind him by doing the devil's work. When you stand across the ring from Kane, you are getting a frightening glimpse of hell on earth. Corey, we know Kane does not possess things like empathy a conscience or even fear. Will Kane's sadistic side guide him to victory tonight? You bet. Kane's no regular mortal, Cole. His decades-long trail of broken bodies is a direct result of Kane's love of inflicting unspeakable pain onto others. Tonight, Kane needs to show even more aggression. Producing a trampling. Nasty one right to the chest. He avoids the damage. Solid punch. He caught him by surprise. Oh, what a DDT. Wow. Referee breaks the count. Looks like a rope break. And he's able to fight Kane off. Ooh, stinging kick. And there he attacked Kane like his life depends on toppling this monster. 
Gets him with the counter. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Yeah. How did scouted? Oh, red right in there. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. And the body's getting worked over. Something's about to go either very wrong or very wrong. Taking flight. Nobody home. He takes hold. Brought down with a DDT. And he's taking this to the outside now. He's stalking his opponent from the top. Sky high. What a clothesline. He thinks he has it. What? Oh, he kicked out. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Dodges. What a cross body. And there's into the cover. Barely kicks out. And frustration might be starting to set in. Big elbow drop. Oh, that's bad. Kane's face is making me weak to my stomach. Oh, man. Kane turns it around. He's got him in the crosshairs. And out of the ring he goes. Oh, boy. Where's Kane going? From the top. Oh, no. Crashing hard onto the floor. And that might have been too erratic of a decision to take such a high risk at this junction of the match. From the apron, through the air, and connects! Kane gets out of the way. And he'll come back from under the apron. Close fist connects. Sharp punch. He's on his heels a bit now. There's been plenty of action in this match, and the cost of that is really showing now. Top rope, putting it all on the line. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. And he's out of there in a nick from the top. He catches Kane with a counter. Drop piercing seated drop kick, and now he's giving you all another chance to simply take it all in. All oh, on the apron, lifting it up into the ring. Bam, suplex. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Oh no. Now possibly setting up for a submission maneuver. All right, this one's over. Tap out coming. Oh, and he gets out. Perhaps some renewed life in him now. All the way up and down. Choke slam straight to hell. Kane delivering his own brand of hell. Uh-oh, he could be looking for a submission here. And you imagine what it would do. A win tonight, man. Tap out. The singles match has come to an end. Wow. Here is your winner, the he really got the better of the opposition here. I agree, it was quite the display tonight. You could just sense the intensity in the air throughout this one. Yeah, this win was well earned.